eight for eight for the year. Make it nine for nine. How about that substitution? 6'1", sophomore from Alpharetta. And he's trying to go 10 for 10 for the year. Nope. Gotta go in a hurry. Two-point game. Washington. Well, he got hit. Foul on Garcia. He got hit. The foul is starts a little. And you want sports? You can see all the sports you want here with Washington. Because in air, once again, he found a way to make contact. There's Garcia. And he will go to the line where he is two of three gonna, today. And they're going to check where he's going to shoot it from exactly. there. Exactly. The quick look like it may have been a three. Here's This will give us a look. Both behind right there. He's in air. He can cross that line in air. That's not a problem. There he is. Washington will go to the free throw line for his three shot. He's shooting three. 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 And do the quick back math, folks. They're down two. 73 plus three equals a win. And he's a freshman. For the season, 72%. If he hits three in a row, Memphis goes to the NCAA championship. Oh. Two to go. Boy, does that take the pressure off right now? He's got to go one for two for a tie. You can't describe the pressure here. I will be hard-pressed to tell you right now that if you'll, you'll see a more pressurized situation this year in this tournament as we're watching right here. Tournament's on the line. Louisville wins! Somebody's got to go help that kid out. And the first man there is John Calipari. Please remain in your seats. He needed three. He could convert only one. And sadly for Darius Washington Jr., you've seen a moment that he will never, ever forget. He hit the first. He missed numbers two and three. Louisville wins the Conference USA Championship. They will advance to the NCAA tournament. The season has come to a close for the Memphis Tigers. So for Jim Spinarkel, I'm Bern Lundquist saying so long from Memphis, where the final score dramatically, 75-74. Coming up next, the Big Ten semifinal. Minnesota takes on top-ranked Illinois. This has been a presentation of CBS Sports, home of the men's NCAA Basketball Championship.